Hey guys, let's just say you got one of these fine tractors here and the fan belt is on its last leg and we're talking borrowed time. Yep, you said it Fluffy. Come on up here and give me a hand. There you go. Now when I say borrowed time, I'm not talking like maybe next spring we'll get to this. I'm talking like if you were to fire it up and pull it back in the barn, you might be doing it without an alternator belt. That's what I'm talking about. So you look at this and you say, well, we'll just loosen up bolt, we'll change the belt. And then you see that. You know what I'm talking about right there. You know, she's connected all the way through. There's, there's no way. Are you kidding me? Am I going to have to split this to change a belt? Why would anybody do that? Seriously, come on. And just wait a minute, relax. Take it from me, changing that belt is gonna be easier than a drunk college girl at a frat party. Okay guys, there's only a couple things you really need to know. One, you can do the entire job with a 14 millimeter wrench. Two, all those bolts will come out. Three, that's going to be hard to show you, but behind the heads of these bolts, you might have to roll the engine a little bit, there is recesses into this pump so you can screw the bolt all the way out and into the pump enough to get all of this loose. So, what do you say? Let's just jump right in and get this going. Now the first thing you're going to want to do is figure out where the bolt hole, these bolt recesses are. Make sure you can kind of get your finger into them because they're either going to be rusty or full of grime and nasty stuff. But you got to get it rolled over to that point. Ugh, nope, not going to happen that way. Okay, I lied. You will need a second tool. Little engine roller over. Oh, went the wrong way. Close. Oh, come on, I'm so close. That should about do it. Okay, now we'll just, uh, you know what? Let's not do the easiest one first. Let's do the hardest one first. Get that out of the way. Just a word of advice, because, you know, bad things happen to good people. If you're using one of these ratcheting gear wrenches, they're great and they're handy. Um, downside, if you get the bolt out just a little too far, um, your ratcheting wrench is now trapped in there. And, uh, you know, you're, you're working against yourself at that point. But just keep that in mind. Look at those magic fingers. That's what she said. And now the last one. Come on. There. Ooh, perfect. Okay. I like it. Okay, now the next step, guys. I want you to pay close attention. Okay, this is where things get exciting. Remember my uh, tire tool that I used to roll the engine over? She's gonna double for us. Into this pulley here. There. Lucky, lucky. Oops. You reach her in behind 
That'll work. And look, lo and behold, you got room now. How about that? They didn't screw us over after all. Okay, I don't know about y'all, but when it comes to projects that I have to work on, which, well, let's face it, that happens all the time. Not the sentiment of work smarter, not harder. Now, sure, we could wrestle this belt out of here and pull it through the fan and, you know, bingo. Done. So take a look at what we got here, guys. This is, uh, that's a Supremium right there. Yep, that's good. Sure. Nevertheless, needless to say, this baby was preparing to leave me stranded somewhere way out where I don't want to be with a really, really, really hot tractor, far from tools and civilization. I think we did the right thing today. So yesterday, I went to my local auto parts house and picked up this Gate 7570 belt. Let's see if it looks close. Oh, I think that'll, I think that'll be just fine. Okay. I'm going to use this little cut in the uh, fan shroud here to my advantage. Sneak this belt through. Okay. Yep. JT's barn and grill. Watch me struggle. The struggle is real. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. And a little bit. Oh, there. Okay. Hey. 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 Okay. Now we're gonna sneak this under this crank. Get you in here. Now they give you just enough room in there, and I mean just enough. Come on, Betty. Let's get him off of there. Yeah, there we go. Reach up through the bottom. There. Okay. 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 Still got our same. Oh, made a liar out of me again. You need a third tool. Eh, figures. Okay. The old trusty, oh, dummy, come on. First time ever working on something. Got him loose. Nope. Nope. There. Trusty tire tool one last time. And you just want to get these, you know, fiddle string tight. That sounds just fine. Okay. That looks good. That looks good. When you get everything snugged up, give everybody a who's your daddy real quick. Yep. Yep. Yeah, okay. I feel good about that. Fluffy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, just like I said, piece of cake, nothing to it. Anybody can do that. Let's fire this up, make sure it doesn't fly off. And then I'm going for a test drive. It's a nice day. It's too nice. It's too nice to do inside the house stuff. So, yep, going for a ride. Great. So hopefully today, you all learned something. And if you already knew what was going on, well, hopefully you got a laugh. 
Thanks for joining me today, guys. We'll see you next time. I'm going for a ride. <laughs>